New York, New York, the city that never sleeps. They say if you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. For the past two centuries, New York has been the largest and wealthiest American city. New York has always meant possibility, for it was an urban center on its way to becoming something better. Being both foreign and fearsome tests the stamina of everyone who enters it, consisting of five boroughs, Manhattan, the Bronx, Brooklyn, Queens, and Staten Island. New York is the most ethnically diverse, religiously varied, commercially driven, famously congested, and in the eyes of many, the most attractive urban center in the country. No other city has contributed more images to the collective consciousness of Americans. Wall Street means finance. Broadway is synonymous with theater. Fifth Avenue is automatically paired with shopping. But if you're someone like me who likes to ball on a budget, Canal Street is a great option for shopping in New York City. In Harlem evokes images of the Jazz Age, African-American aspirations, and the slums. With a population of 8.6 million people, New York has more Jews than Tel Aviv, more Irish than Dublin, more Italians than Naples, and more Puerto Ricans than San Juan. Its symbol is the Statue of Liberty, but the metropolis itself is an icon, a conglomeration of local neighborhoods that provide them with similar cuisines, languages, and experiences. New York is perhaps the most fitting representative of a diverse and powerful nation. The first pizzeria established in America was in 1905 by Gennaro Lombardi. I was staying in Queens, so I had to hit the streets for the Italian eats. I pulled up the Sunnyside Pizza, and they did not disappoint with their slices. Next, I went to Chinatown for some authentic Chinese food from Spicy Village, where they had a really good spicy beef udon noodle dish. Now, time for dessert. Cheesecake. I went to a Lean's Cheesecake, where they have been trapping out these creamy delights since 1975. And by many publications, they are touted as one of the best, if not the best, cheesecake spot in New York City. You can't forget the all-American New York dog at Times Square and the Nathan's dog on Coney Island. While I was at Coney Island, I decided to hit the boardwalk and put my feet in the ocean, giving me a chance to reflect on this trip thus far. 